Now, Microsoft will tell you this data is temporary. They'll tell you it gets deleted when you clear your clipboard or restart your computer. But here's what they don't tell you. Behind the scenes, Windows is creating screenshot captures of your clipboard items, not just text, visual screenshots, and it saves these as PNG image files in a hidden system folder. I tested this for 30 days. I deliberately copied sensitive information, bank account numbers, passwords from my password manager, private Discord messages. Then I cleared my clipboard history multiple times. I even restarted my computer. I checked the recycle bin. Empty. I checked clipboard history. Empty. So everything should be gone, right? Wrong. Here's the first location. Windows hides these screenshots. I need you to copy this path exactly. I'll put it in the description. Most people never see this because File Explorer hides it by default. But PowerShell reveals what's really stored in those system folders. What I'm about to show you is something most users never even think about. Windows doesn't just take screenshots. It stores them in hidden system folders that you can't normally open. But PowerShell doesn't care about that. It shows everything. So here's the command I ran. Get child item. Path dollar sign env colon local app data backslash packages recurse filter screen clip error action. Silently continue. That command searches every folder inside your app data packages directory and looks for anything with screen clip in the name. When I ran it, I found something interesting. Files ending with dot dat, like this one. 63703FE3CICDA 147D9 underscore screenshot dot dat. These dot dat files aren't normal screenshots. They're hidden cache files that Windows uses to store thumbnail captures of your clipboard content. Think of them like tiny memory snapshots, bits and pieces of whatever you copied. And here's the strange part. File Explorer shows nothing in this folder. Completely empty. But PowerShell still finds the files. That means they're hidden from the interface level, but not from the system. So what's inside them? When I decoded a few of these, they contained raw image data. Literally screenshots of whatever I had copied over the past few weeks. Even though I'd cleared my clipboard and restarted my computer multiple times. Passwords, messages, documents, even banking pages. Still sitting there. If you want to see this for yourself, copy the command exactly as I said it and run it in PowerShell. It's completely safe. You're not deleting anything yet. You're just revealing what's already stored. Now, if you do find files inside these folders, you can delete them manually. But remember, now to delete them safely, you can do it manually in File Explorer or just use one PowerShell command. Here it is. Get child item, path dollar sign env colon. Local app data backslash packages recurse include asterisk dot dat comma asterisk screen clip asterisk error action silently continue pipe remove item force error action silently continue this scans your hidden system folders finds every cached screenshot and wipes them instantly next time you copy something so if you want to completely clear them and stop them from coming back you can use a cleanup script. The one I created deletes all screenshot cache files, disables clipboard history, and prevents Windows from recreating the folders. I'll link it below for anyone who wants to try it safely. So, yeah, Windows was saving this. Hidden right inside your user folder. Invisible in File Explorer, but clear as day in PowerShell. Makes you wonder what else is quietly being stored on your system, doesn't it? Don't forget to like and subscribe. There's a lot more Windows secrets I'm uncovering. And, and trust me, this was just the beginning.